So what we have here is an older street glide seat. Our customer actually just saw a bike seat that we finished up about a month ago from another customer, one of his friends, and said he wants something similar. We did the other one was black with all green threads on it, like a heavier green serifil thread on it. And this one he wants it black with a cobalt blue because his bike is cobalt blue. Normally darker blues on black, I don't highly, I don't really recommend them because it's um, it's really subtle and you don't show it. But the serifil blue with the heavier thread, it's almost like electric. It really pops, so it looks really nice. So we're gonna go through and do that. On his buddy seat, we actually did a strip down the middle with pinstripe graphics, like old school hot rod pinstripe. He wants to do uh, diamonds down the center. So what we did is we took the seat, and like I said, this is an older style one, so it's kind of, it looks like an older road glide seat actually, but it's, a, it's definitely a street glide. We lowered it down, we added a little bit to the top to give him a little bit more back support, because this style seat was actually higher and lower, so it almost had no back support. So now he'll have some back support. We left it a little wider in the back so the rear passenger could still have comfort. And we obviously shaved the front of it out so that there's less pressure up front. Very common thing we're always doing. Now, um, what we're gonna do is normally we would actually go through and put a different foam on here and sculpt it. But because the cover that we're putting on here actually has a sew foam that we put on it, it's gonna be a thicker cover and that will add a little bit of padding to it, but it'll also lift it a little bit. And we don't wanna lift this one. A lot of times we'll do like a closed cell foam, we'll sculpt it and body work it so it looks really nice. And then we put just the vinyl or leather on it, and then it'll be nice and tight and crisp and be exactly where we cut it down to as far as the height. This one here, we don't wanna raise it, and we are doing the cover with sew foam. So that's the net. Well, the next step, we're gonna tape it up and pattern it. All right, so I'm about to tape this off. I just went and marked my center points have all the center points on there, very important. And we are gonna tape it and pattern it and make a seat cover. All right, you're gonna have to bear with us here because we are a real shop and this video, I wasn't gonna even put it up there, but I wanted to show you the seat that we made. And so it's gonna be a really short video, obviously, but what's funny is when we started this seat, we started the video, but we're a real shop. We get overwhelmed with all other stuff that come in. We had a couple jobs that we had to put out some fires and we had to go and jump on them and get them done. So then we came back to this seat and I thought we had footage of us making it, but we didn't. So I'm sorry about that, but I did want to show you the seat and tell you a little bit about it. So as I said in the beginning of the video, one of his friends actually had us do a seat about a month ago and he saw it and loved it. And he wanted it similar, but black with cobalt blue stitch. And he didn't want it as busy as the other seat we did. The other seat we did a lot of double stitching and stuff, so we wanted to keep it a little simpler. Being that this is the older street glide seat, normally they're only about this high and the foam's, the foam's about here and the back's only about that high, so you don't really have a lot of back support. So we lowered it and we also raised the back. So this gives them a little bit more back support, kind of like a newer street glide seat would be, um, but it still has that old cool style rear seat. Um, we did shave it down just a little bit to match the front seat. And then we did a, he wanted a very durable marine grade vinyl. So we just did this black vinyl here and then did the cobalt blue stitching in it. And this is what we got. Mm -hmm. 